I will just uh, start. I think that uh, we prepared a program which uh, we can't make a mistake on this part. Uh, good afternoon, uh, you all. I'm uh, representing EFTA, the European Vocational Training Association, based in uh, in Brussels, founded in 1991, uh, 1998. Sorry, we are not that old and uh, and still active. Um, maybe you will know uh, EFTA, maybe not. But to say uh, what is our mission? Uh, our mission is to facilitate the relationship. The between stakeholders in the field of VET, so also CVET, in order to enable them to, to share knowledge and, and practices and how to shape the training, vocational training in the future. We are looking for a fight, far sighted uh, ecosystem involving skills, new skills, new jobs, and overall a new VET. And in that field, we are working closely together with a lot of other organizations like. Uh, my two colleagues uh, are representing uh, EFET and, uh, and EVBB. Uh, we saw each other uh, yesterday, uh, Theodore, uh, in, in a meeting. And uh, that is also, we are quite involved in, uh, in many projects together to, uh, to get VET on a higher level than it is. And maybe I can, uh, can tell you something. I, I'm very sorry that I was not able to join you this morning. I was traveling back from our meeting yesterday in uh, in Brussels, so I didn't hear all other presentations. But uh, I, I can be clear that that small medium enterprises, in my opinion, are very important motors in uh, the whole education of um, of people working in the industry, uh, as in as in vet. Um, I have learned many of my basic skills. In, comp in small companies uh, doing uh, doing a job. And I think that we should uh, try to, to organize a way of having the theoretical uh, part of, of our scholarship in schools, combining with uh, uh, training on the working floor. So for that, I think that uh, there is a, a huge role for SMEs uh, they are a, a very important motor of uh, of economies in Europe and all over the world, and that is also and that is my daily business. I have our own training company, and we are mostly working in CVET, uh, the continuous VET, uh, the training of of adults of professionals. We are now training people for uh, professions that may not exist or are not existing anymore in the future, and we see that already in the industry to keep people up. And we have found them, we have to, to bind them, but we also have to fascinate them. And if they want to follow the developments which are in the industry going faster and faster, and not only on green skills or technical skills or, or digital skills, we have to, um, to, to keep on training and, and educating them. So I think we have a very important role there. And I think the European Commission with their projects and the cooperation we have with many other organizations are trying to to organize that in a, in a very good way and to learn from each other. Some countries are very well organized on, on VET. Other ones have a lot of challenges. So we can, uh, by working together, we can uh, make Europe better. So that's my introduction. 